Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Weta and I'm an apologetic, unapologetic shopper. Today I'm using this Nova NAVI Rose Collection Kit. Isn't it gorgeous? I'm loving the colors. And of course, yes, I know it says Hello Fall, but it is still cold and we can use what's around it and save the Hello Fall for next year. So I had this resized so it's a little bit smaller so that I could use it on my vertical layout using the time frame on here. It has time, different times on here. Time block. That's what it's called. So we've got that um, changed. The time didn't work for me, so I changed it out. I'm playing with this. I've changed it out to work for me during my time. My day starts at 3.45. So, and it ends at 6 for work. I had so much uh, time in here that I did not have time for the things that I want to do for that day. So, I'm trying to make sure I follow a schedule with the way that I work. And with having to really rest my body due to my illness. I think that this is going to work for me. So, I wanted to share this uh -oh, with you, uh, with how I decorate it. Now, this can be a little tricky because it does have the time uh, in here. So, it doesn't give you a lot of room for decorating. But it can be decorated and it can be really, really pretty. So, we're going to get started with our decoration i want to thank all of my subscriber subscribers i can't talk to them thank you so much for subscribing to my channel i truly appreciate it if you're new to my channel thank you as well if you happen to stumble upon my channel thank you please hit that subscribe like and comment button it will definitely help my channel so I've already went ahead and put in Monday and Thursday and uh, this week is going to be somewhat different from and this is a scarf just a small one yeah uh, it's going to be a little bit different because my baby is having surgery unfortunately he's he has to have a little surgery so, um, I'm, of course, you know, I'm going to be there with him. So, things are going to be a little bit different um, after starting Thursday. So, uh, I think this is going to work out really well for me. I am if one that, um, I think if I have a schedule, that's why I like planning. If I have a schedule or time frame to get stuff done, then it it just works better for me. I'm able to get that done. And when I come in, instead of sitting down or eating and staying up a little bit, I will, you know, get myself going and get what I got done, get to do, I got to do and get in the bed like I'm supposed to. So that is my goal is to get what I have to get done. So that I can get in bed because, y'all, yeah, 3.45, between uh, 3.45 and 3.30, it comes early. Now, if for some reason I happen to wake up because I can't sleep, sometimes I go ahead and go into work. Sometimes I've been there as early as 3.30. I don't mind doing that uh, if I when I'm woke. Um and if you're just laying there tossing, why not be making them coins? You know, make them coins. So that's how I look at it, you know. So we are going to just, and I'm not just going to decorate this top up here. I want to show you. So if you adjust it to your time frame, because like this started at 6, I think. 6 a.m. And I'm well at work at 6 a.m., you know, generally I start work at five and I get off at six and then it didn't have much time after six. So like I said, uh, you can't adjust it to your schedule. 
you know, if you are a night shift worker and you have a lot of day, you can just, like I said, just do like I did and, um, and change the dates. But I'm going, like I said, I'm just playing with it. So next week I'm going to try to make this a little neater and I've been playing with it already a little bit. So it, um. It seems to uh, be able to work for me. It looks like it's going to work for me. So I don't have a, don't have a lot to put on here. And I don't need a lot uh, to put on here. But it's just enough to definitely get it decorated. The way that, you know, I would want it decorated. Okay. I'm going to take that up. I'm going to hold off on that for a while. I want to put this down right here. So, <clears throat> let me see. What is it that I was want to talk with you about? Let's see here. I'm trying to think. There we go. Sometimes I can't do two things at once. Has anyone tried this? And uh, how is it working for you? Please, uh, in the comments below, let me know if you tried it. If you've made some changes, uh, what changes did you make to it? How did how did you uh, get it to flow for you? I'm really anxious to, to know that. This is one that I said that I didn't think would work for me last year. And as, you know, things changed with this COVID virus and so forth. So I am think now have rethought it and I feel like it is going to work for me. Yep, I feel like it's going to work for me. I love this doll here. Isn't she just pretty? She is just so pretty. I love that. We're getting ready to go into February, y'all. This is February. This month is already year, brother. It's starting to move along really fast. Really fast. About as fast as last year, but hopefully it will be better than last year. But they found a new strain. And that strain is very deadly. And each day, it seems like they're uh, finding it in more and more states. So I hope that everyone is being as safe as they can. Stay home, if at all possible. I wish I could work from home. I, my uh, company doesn't offer that for us. Unfortunately, I wish that they did. Believe me, I would stay in. Please, if if at all possible, and I know that there are some who cannot wear a mask, but if at all possible, wear your mask. Be safe, you know, and let's be courteous toward each other. We definitely want to be courteous toward each other. We don't want to... Uh, to be rude to each other. That's not how we want to be. You know, we're in this thing together. And it's going to take all of us together to get through this thing. So please, please, let's be uh, courteous to each other. Let's be helpful if we can. You know, if you can check on your neighbor, check on your neighbor. You know, see how they, they are doing. You know, people are dying every day, every minute, every hour. People are losing a loved one. And you just, just never know. We've had a couple of deaths in our congregation. I'm not saying it was due to COVID. I don't know. I didn't ask, you know. But we, it's not really important. The thing is, 
someone has lost a husband, a father, a brother, you know, and, and that's, that's say a friend, you know, a friend. So people are going through a hard time. You know, people have lost their jobs. This thing has made people lose their jobs, their homes. It's hard to feed their families. You know, so we don't know what a person is going through. We definitely want to be uh, kind and courteous uh, to, to everyone. You know what I'm saying? To everybody. So if you can be, please think of that, you know. Uh, when you're talking to people, you know, when you're, uh, when you are uh, out and uh, maybe someone skipped line or something like that. Is it worth all of that to be upset uh, about someone skipping line or not having a product? You know, the male people are working hard. I have lost four packages. Two that I'm probably not going to get refunded for. You know, that I'm not going to get a refund for at all. So, you know, don't, don't, uh, don't get upset uh, about things because we're going through, we're going through a hard time here. I'm going to put some right here. Everybody's got things to do, but, you know, and I know people are upset that their packages are late. But know that these workers are working hard. They're working around the clock, nonstop. Some haven't skipped a lick, a beat at all since this pandemic started. They're working crazy hours, long hours. And that's not what they need to hear from any of us. You know what I'm saying? We, they don't. They don't need to hear any of any of that negativity uh, from us. You know, if anything, just a build, a build, people. You know. So let's see here. I have some Zoom meetings. Uh, let me put them in. I had my scissors right here. Okay, I put them back in there. Uh, that I want to put down as well. Okay, uh-uh. So let me put those down. We'll go ahead and I have them at 7 o'clock. And believe me, sometimes, even though these meetings are every week, I can get distracted and I don't, uh uh, I don't want to, to do that. I want to definitely make sure that I'm on the meetings and on time and that I get on them, period. Because I, I did miss the first one, but I haven't missed any more since. I can't get the sticker off of the sticky, the paper off of this sticker. Hold on here. There we go. So let's put this at seven on Wednesday. Did I get the stick? Nope, I didn't get the sticky off the back of it. All of it. There we go. That's on Wednesday and Sunday at 7 o'clock. So, and this will be the sheet. You know, you do your, when I do my catch-all, that has everything on it, which I still do. Everything that goes on that sheet. But this right here breaks down my time. This is going to help me when I come in, um, but you know, to know that today, you know what, we need. I need to clean the bathroom before I go to bed, or after I take my shower, or which is most likely when I'm going to do it. It's right after I take my shower. 
and I'm trying to, you know, keep doing that. Sometimes I don't feel like it. I have to do it the next day, but I'm going to uh, try my best to to uh, keep up with this schedule. You know, I'm all about being orderly. That's what I want to be, is orderly. Yeah, orderly. And on Saturdays and Friday morning, I'm going to do some letter writing. And that will be it. That will start at 10. So let me put that down. And just being organized, you know, it's just, it works out better for me. I've had a planner, I know, since I was 15. Well, I had a journal. And then I went to a planner after graduating. Well, that's at 10. And it always has worked for me, you know. It has uh, helped me tremendously. Especially now that I've gotten older, you know. I forget things and sometimes I've got to have a little reminder there about these things. Well, I want to do that on um, here as well. And then on Sunday, we have our morning meeting at 10 o'clock as well. So we'll go ahead and put all of that in here. Okay, and we don't have a midweek meeting today this week because we we have a convention on Sunday. So, but I still have to study and, and prepare for that. For this week so we'll get that done like we usually do and I'm gonna put work uh, and then I'm gonna put work down to right there and then that will take care of that to show me the days that I work. There we go. Okay. And let's see here. What else? I'm going to put one more work right here. And then I think we're going to wrap it up, y'all. I think we're going to wrap it up. Okay. So that is my spread. And this is uh, going to keep me uh, with the time uh, on here. It's going to keep me a little better organized. And I think that turned out really well. I'm loving, loving this, this uh, kit. It's a beautiful kit. Uh, please check her out. I think you will like her work. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. I would definitely appreciate it. As stated, please, please, please be as safe as you possibly can. Remember, there's only one you, only you can take care of you. Until next time, bye.